All right, hi everybody. Uh, in this particular question here, we're taking a look at the number of permutations of the letters in a word um, with, with repetition here. So, in this case, we're using the letters of the word intermittent, okay? And there are 12 letters here, okay? So think of that, we've got 12 letters, but we have got, let me see, one, two I's, uh, one, two N's, one, two, three, four T's, two E's, okay? And that appears to be all of the repetition we've got there. There's a lot getting repeated here. We have to consider that every, for every question that we work on here. So let's take a look at this first one. How many ways can we permute the, all these 12 letters without re, uh, restrictions? Well, there's 12 factorial ways that those can all be written out here. However, because of the repetition, like right now, if I was to swap these two I's, uh, you wouldn't notice a difference. So there are two factorial ways I can do that, but that creates this, these two different groups of permutations that are going to look identical to each other here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide by 2 factorial. I will divide by 2 factorial for the n's, 4 factorial for the t's, and then my additional 2 factorial for the e's. And this right here represents the total number of ways we can, we can permute those letters without restriction. Um, it's important to note here that when you're dealing with the letters in a word, the assumption is that you cannot repeat those letters unless they've been repeated for you. Okay? That's, that's typically the way we approach these things. When we're talking about the ways of permuting uh, or coming up with numbers, we automatically assume we can repeat digits unless we're told not to, but this is a little different.